So I think I'm just, uh, I'm gonna try something new today. The stream. Just not gonna talk. Uh, we, we, uh... We, we, we got some, before, before I go silent, we're gonna, we're gonna... Credit, we got Sufon here with some amazing art. Incredible art. Uh, it's Pizza Tower and Isaac at the same time. It's the poop pizza from the sewer level. Uh... It it looks it looks great, Sufon. Thank you. It for some reason it, it makes me think of like Delta Rune. It makes me think like the environment looks like a Delta Rune environment. I don't know why. Oh, but thank you, Sufon. Uh, so we're gonna. By the way, I'm totally full of shit. I don't know why I said I'm not gonna talk today. <laughs> we're gonna play Isaac just because I want to unwind. Uh, after some nice. Stressful Celeste. Uh, Hylix has been cool, but uh, I want to give a gap stream. I don't want to just do Hylix two times in a row. I try not to stream games two times in a row, but I often break that rule with things that I'm just super enamored with. Okay, uh. Yeah, I don't know why the fuck I said that. I, we're just gonna have some fun. Just have some fun. Uh, what about Eden? I have 450 Eden tokens. Uh, why not just do this? I think Eden's like infinite fun. Okay. That's Mega Blast. Pretty good start. Eden? D's? Nuts. Uh, goddamn. That, that's, that's a good starting item. That is a good starting item. Hold R. Okay. Uh, I'll just get this. Been a little while, huh? Yeah, fuck it. Okay, Tiny Toma, that's pretty good. I want a mod that makes Tiny Toma have, like, crutches. So it'll be like Tiny Timma. <laughs> uh, I'm being pretty uh, lax about just picking up Soul Hearts straight away, because we started off with a Soul Heart anyway. So I'm just going to end up wasting one on this Curse Room door, because I... I do curse rooms, like, a lot. I very rarely skip them. And, you know, frequently they just give me spiders, but, uh... That's fine. Whoa, that guy almost got me. My damage is not great. Actually, no, my damage is fun. Actually, this is a really great Eden start. We've got lots of, uh, keys. And I've got this Ace of Spades to use on a room full of enemies. This is not- this is not a room full of enemies. I should just be using my Mega Blast. I don't know why I'm not- oh god. Okay, I'll just save it for next floor. It's good for just wiping an entire- like, getting it this early on, it's just a free entire floor. But I also- I think it's because I want to use the Ace of Spades. Well, that's lame. This room sucks. Getting the thing in the middle is always a huge pain. Okay, we got a weird- I, I don't know that I'm familiar with this version of, uh... Gemini. I've been kind of feeling the hankering to play some, like, Flash Isaac lately, actually. It's just such a vibe, that old game. It's got an uncapturable vibe that Rebirth didn't quite get again, but it tried. I, of course, love Rebirth. But, like, 
I don't know. This could be a hush run with, with the, the items that we've got, so I'm pausing. Maybe for another Flash Game Friday. I already did a Flash Game Friday where I did uh, Flash Isaac. 100% Flash Isaac? I don't think so. I'm gonna try to get this. Okay, that's good, actually. It launched it out of the way. Judgment. Okay, uh, we're just gonna go. Could do alt path. I think I think I'm gonna try to go for like delirium. Okay. Big room. Could use the ace of spades here. Uh, no, don't kill them. I wanted to split the big poops into little poops. Okay, whatever. Fuck this. Die. Yeah, that's fine. Die. Okay. Yep. Ooh, uh, yeah, do it. That's plenty of keys. That's a ton. That's, that's more than I will ever need. Okay, I left the tech behind, but whatever. Who gives a shit about the tech? Yeah, Wiggle Worm being a passive. There's a few things about the old game that are just goofy now. Okay, that's whatever. I think it would be funnier if Leech was spelled like Leech, you know? If it was spelled like that. Okay, uh, tempting to get that candle, but I think Mega Blast is gonna be the one for me. What is this shopkeep? I'm sorry, is that Xavier Renegade Angel? It's got a snake hand and nipples and a beak. Is that supposed to be Xavier? I still want Bella to watch Xavier Renegade Angel. I have no idea if she's gonna love it or hate it. She didn't like Tick Tone. She was like, can we stop watching this? Which has been my experience with like basically everyone I've tried to show Tick Tone to. Which is sad, because Tick Tone's awesome. <laughs> but like, I kind of get it. But just describing, I get great joy out of just describing Xavier Renegade Angel to people. I'm like, yeah, the main character has backwards knees and a snake for a hand and uh, six, six nipples and a beak. I'm gonna skip Devil, I think. Uh, I think I'm just gonna skip Devil. Oh. Oh my lord. Ace of Diamonds. Soul of Bethany, just use it. Strength. Honestly, just use it. Judgment. Judgment is a bomb beggar. Okay. Yeah, whatever, dude. And, you know, this is cheating when you're trying to go for Hush, but I don't really care. I fucking got Dead God. I can do whatever I want. Although I cheated on the way to Dead God, so... Take that as you will. Yeah, fuck it. I'm about to Ace of Diamonds a room full of enemies. I still need the faster, the, like, time machine mod that makes, uh, beggars go faster. It turns every beggar in the game into a chooser. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, ideally, we want a room with, like, a bunch of those little yellow flies. I think they're called sand flies. Hold on. I've got one bomb. We can check for secret room and get this Dwayne and get a coin. Oh my god, it was small rock. Okay. This will give me breakfast. No. <laughs> I was really hoping. Uh... Is there anything here that'll let me fly or anything? I should've just blew up the donation machine. Whatever, it doesn't matter that much. Uh, okay. I think I just- I think we're just gonna go. Whew. So we're just gonna- we're just gonna relax today. We're just- I'm not gonna- 
Not gonna play some like blisteringly fucking frustrating Celeste level. And and I you know Hylix. I, there's a few series I need to finish up. Uh, nice. One of which is still gotta do the part two of the Pizza Tower demos. I really want to try to like grind to beat the Grinch off stream. Also Invisible Shopkeeper. I really want to grind to beat the Grinch demo off stream, but I I should probably just not do that. Oh god, this is the worst room to activate this in. That would not have been a terrible room to use the base in. Really? I can't use a key? Okay. That kind of stinks, because that means this is just going to get wasted. Yep. Ripperoni. Him, he's pogging. Nice. What if I used Ace of Diamonds on that? Those coins. It could give me a dime, guys. I still gotta do a Katana Zero speedrun. I think I've decided that I'm just gonna fucking... I, I'm, I'm just gonna do a casual speedrun. I'm not gonna try to get, like, the achievement. Because fuck that. I just don't want to. It's just... Too much work, and I'd much rather just have fun with the game and do goofy strats and shit. Rather than try to actually go for an amazing time. Oh, perfection. For me, I'm perfect. Also, is this gonna give me the mom transformation? I think it will. Yeah. It, it, it says in the... Description thing. Is this gonna kill perfection, though? I mean, Perfection's not doing anything for me right now, so... Damn it! That's kind of what I wanted to avoid. Whatever. I'm so slow. In the game! Say it with me, folks. I also want to play Toho. I got I got to get along with Toho 6. Uh I have the game. I just I just have been putting it off. Oh my god. Post buff a theme. That's huge. Is also huge. I love I, I love how updates can make it so that like what was previously like one of the most fucking meh items in the entire game becomes like holy shit. It's a shame that I don't have uh, perfection anymore. But I don't think I was gonna keep it, frankly. Okay. <laughs> Could get the funny penny and duplicate <laughs> Mega Blast. But, uh, no! Did I mention that I I cheated and I hacked the game so that it would give me free Mega Blast at the very beginning? I'm a cheater. I cheated. Ooh. Is this the room? Come on. Just... <laughs> Ace of that was... Maybe not the best place to do it, but... I think that wasn't the worst. We heart cheating. We stand cheaters in this household. Okay, stop giving me soul hearts. I'm just gonna throw them away on the curse room every time. Okay. <laughs> it never gets old. The, like, boss music starts up, it, like, shows the title card, and then I just fucking... Ah! I'm a fire in my laser, guys. Okay. Pad, that's awesome. Hey, but guys, it'll contribute to the mother transformation. Look on the bright side. Mega Blast is legitimately, like, a faster way to travel, too. Not just because you clear rooms instantly, but because, uh... 
it lets me like move faster. I can propel myself with it. I don't know why I'm doing this. Okay. Don't think I care about those. Oh, and now I can't go into the... No, I could... You know? I'm just so slow. Belt! That is what the doctor motherfucking ordered. <laughs> oh god! Oh, oh, please no. Please no. Let me get it. Thank you. Oh. Okay. Very cool. The speed. Oh my god, the- both of the hearts are in an unreachable location. I didn't realize. Oh, my creep isn't working on these guys, like, creep. Oh, but the leech, spelled like this, is helping me. So many cool cards. Two of spades I think we just use. Use either, here's, here's strategy, basic two of spades strategy. Use it until, like, keep it, hold on to it until you either need to use a key or find a key. No, just keep it until you need to use a key. Just... Full stop. Because now that key that I just picked up there is going to turn into two keys. That was convenient. Justice. There's more. Give me that. Oh my god. Uh... That was bad. Okay. Oh my god, a fame, a fame! <laughs> Why do I get so many, like, cracked runs? Why? Is it because I'm great at the game? I think it's because I'm great at the game. Pageant boy, poggers. Angel room, poggers. Ooh. Yikes. I think we take soul locket. Uh, Genesis is cool, but like... Uh, we do have, like, a lot of kind of trash items. I don't know, not trash. Like, I always... Whenever I heard, like, oh, you know, Genesis is so awesome, but, like... Frequently, I don't use it. It's funny, though. It's funny. You make a compelling argument, chat. Goodbye, Mega Blast. Uh, Marrow. That's that good shit. Uh, this one is fire rate up. I think we take that. Magnet. Take the tooth tears. We take the tears up. Damage and luck. I think we take that. Do you like how it put me... I don't really know what's going on with my stats here, because it put my damage lower in the Genesis room than it was at the beginning of the run. But I didn't have an item at the beginning of the run that was affecting my damage. What's up with that? Uh, range and tier size. No, let's take this. I'm, I'm being a greedy, greedy boy. Taking all the, like, damage and tears items. Rubber cement is really good. Intruder's also really good. But I like rubber cement. Rubber cement leads to funny. Uh. Guess we're taking this. Seraphim is cool. Uh, Leo is also cool, though. I'm sorry to be pausing so much, but I still kind of do want to do hush. Oh. Uh, Leo or Seraphim? I think we take Leo. IBS, no. I just love how big Leo makes you. Okay, we'll take the sty, I think. Mm da binky. We're close to that tier cap. I'll take the binky. 
Oh my god, we're over the tier cap. Hell yeah. Paralysis. Fun. And I've got this, like, coin thing. Oh, and I can use this to get three extra soul hearts. Genesis re-rolls your Eden, and that's why I had different hair, too. Oh. Okay, I'm leaving the cricket leg behind. Okay. So we're on Necropolis 1, we got about five minutes left. I have thrown away, willfully, my one means of quickly clearing floors. Oh wait, I have Leo. Hello. Cool room you got here. Be a shame if anything were to happen to it. Ow. I blew up. I got blued up. Bluey. Uh. Cool. Just gonna. I'm, I'm trying to go kind of quick here. I said that Bluey has the worst OP, by the way, and I stand by that. Uh, I like Bluey. It's a fun, cute show. It's surprisingly funny, but... Uh, damn, does it bother me every time that intro, like, stops. It, it's, like, it's like a catchy tune, but it pauses every, like, two seconds. Man, if I could have got this item before Genesis, that would have been cool. As it stands, no way. It's not even funny, that's the thing. Genesis, funny. Cursed Eye, not even funny. Not even once. This was generally a bad idea, doing this room. I wish there was a way to, like, quickly, on controller, get rid of the, uh, the HUD, the, the, like, item description HUD. Like, fuck Cursed Eye. It's just terrible. It's just, like, a fucking dog shit item. Oh, and I got Holy Shield as my, like, Eden reroll. I didn't even pick up on that. See, these enemies, when you have the ace cards, these guys are, like, one of the best things to find. But unfortunately, I only have a boosted Empress card now. So interesting, I learned something I didn't know. Fuck you. Can't believe I just used pay to play or whatever. Or no, whatever this is. Sticky fingers, <laughs> I don't know. can disable item description HUD in combat. How uh, do I do that? That sounds awesome. Magician. Uh, I think we bring Chariot question mark. That's such a funny, weird card. It's just so, like, extreme. Uh. Fuck. Getting hit. Okay. All that money I saved up went away when I did Genesis 2. Sad. Uh, is it? No. Oh. Damn you. Okay, I'm just casually crunching rocks here. Just eating rocks. Legends eat sand. Okay, we're on one. Yeah. Okay. I did not get the treasure. Looks like we're not getting boss rush here. Uh, but I'm still gonna try to get hush. It's 
It's much easier to rush through the womb than it is earlier floors. Because the womb, the womb has nothing for you. There is nothing for you here. You are going to die. Right, uh, yeah, okay, let's just go. Dogs. Dogs. Gator brain. <laughs> what, for eating rocks? Gator brain. Better to be a gator than a hater. No. This room was a waste of time. I'm still so slow. I have less than one speed. Okay. The shield is nice. I don't know why I did this. Balls, please. Hot speed. That's awesome. Shit, there's money in there, but whatever. I should have saved. I should have used the fool there. God, I love that the shopkeeper's mod also affects these guys. I'm about to die. I'm dead. Cool. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> well, clinging on by the skin of my teeth, probably not gonna make it. Genesis was bad. I, I think I stand by my dislike of Genesis. Here, you know, it had sort of a unique interaction with uh, Eden, but I think I kind of stand by frequently not wanting to take Genesis. Because it just kind of sucks. <laughs> it's just like... If you've got, like, a trash build, then it's good. But it's just not- it's just not amazing. It's especially good if you've got a bunch of items that- Stuff like Mom's Coin Purse that, like, gives you a benefit the instant you pick it up and then never does anything again because that's just free items, basically. What do we got? Uh, it'll be plus, it'll be 0 0.2 speed up. Fuck that. I was kind of hoping it would be health. I don't even know if that can give you health. Don't want to deal with this room. It's a poop enemy. Okay. Uh, we have not found the treasure yet. I am inclined to find the treasure. God. I'm using... I'm using this thing a lot. This is the most I've ever used this active item, I think. Besides, like, funny runs where I, like... get, like, 99 coins and then spam them at the end. I could get Consolation Prize and fool out. God, no! I think I'm gonna do that. Because I'm so slow. Oh my god. The fool. Oh, wait, that gave me so much money. Is this just gonna restart the fight though? <laughs> no, it isn't. I swear I've had it happen sometimes where I go back into that room and pick up more stuff and it like reactivates the fight. I'm really, I'm playing it super fucking safe here. Until I find some help. Guppy uh, has been good to me. Fuck this. Okay. This room kind of seems designed around fucking with people who have Stompy. Which is kind of funny. <laughs> Any room I'm, like, remotely scared of, I just use my money. Is it magic fingers? Okay. The goal has shifted from hush to survive. Just 
outlive the run. I was way too greedy taking all those tears up items. And no health. Right, I can burn the shopkeeps. Guess I'll buy this, but it's unlikely to have anything. Okay. <laughs> I have, uh, say, say walk. Nothing walk past you. Oh, well, I get the win for free. Goodbye. Oh, and a soul heart dropped onto me. You can move a tiny, tiny bit if you mash the movement direction. That's kind of funny. Okay. Just take negative because it's damage. Uh, Polaroid actually with soul hearts only is kind of good. Let's take it. Let's take it. Let's take it. Huge. Come over here. No. Look over here. Hey. Okay. Oh, a secret room got revealed, but... Too late! Okay, so now I get just full map. This is fucking hot! Oh. Bless me. Okay, uh, I should not be fooling around too much here. Uh. Come on! Guaranteed nickel. I should not be screwing around at all. We're trying to get the hush. And then I'm gonna fucking die on hush, and Guppy's Collar is gonna revive me like 50 times. Because Guppy's Collar, it only revives. I shouldn't even say this because. Okay, now we're at tier cap. I shouldn't even say this because it saved my ass twice this run already, but it seems like Guppy's Collar always revives you when it's like completely hopeless anyway. Probably just confirmation bias. This room can fuck right off. Why did I even pick up that bomb? That was like an unnecessary risk. Oh, my tier rate is cool. Okay. I have to do the next floor in like three minutes. Okay, this is gonna kind of fuck up the Polaroid, but whatever. Ghost Pepper, or whatever it is, Bird Eye, or I, I forget. There's two different Pepper items. It was a really good find. Okay, I'll take that. 14 cents, I'll take that. Dun, 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 dun. I'm just gonna go, I we don't have time for this. We don't have time! Okay. Uh, why won't it open? What? Okay. Give me that. I'm out of here. <sighs> okay, where are we going? Where are we going? <laughs> Fuck. Time waste. Get me out of here. We'll be fine, I think. We're, we're good. I can even go to the super secret, I think. And pick up this bomb like an asshole. Oh. Crunch. <laughs> oh, we're, we're fine. I can waste time doing this. This is fine. Fuck. Uh, I have a brain leak. Okay, perfect. Fucking perfect. Because that, that leaves me 15 cents to spend in the hush store. You ever just go shopping in your dead mom's vagina? Actually, hush is supposed to be like a... You know, the Rainbow Hush mod makes it a rainbow baby, I just realized. Because Hush is supposed to be like an unborn 
brother or sister of yours, right? I, I actually... I feel like there was a lot of discourse on, like, Hush lore early on. Ooh. Uh, and, and then it, I never really heard much else later. Ooh, Ace of Diamonds. Goddamn. Oh, I only have one key. How did I use up that many keys on those chests, I guess? Fuck. Uh, we're gonna take Pop. I, I could have sworn on the last floor, after I had done all that angel shit, that I had, like, six keys. So I'm looking at the wrong thing. I should have gone in the shop. I'm an asshole. I forgot. Monster Manuel. Uh... Hmm. No, it's because I fucking opened all the chests. I'm an idiot. I did have six keys. Okay. And I could have picked up the poker chip to Gamba, but whatever. We fine! Oh, I should just use Monster Manuel and then bring... Sticky Fingers in here. Yeah, I'm just gonna call it Sticky Fingers, fuck you. Hush is Isaac confronting his own death. I feel like that's happened like six different times in different bosses. Fuck those. Oh my god! Did you see that homing tear? I am at a speed where those homing tears just hit me. If they, like, are, like, a mile away from me, they'll still hit me. Because I'm so slow. Oh my god, the lasers. The hush lasers. This is fucked. The hush lasers are gonna kill me. I am, I think, above, above base speed, or is base speed, uh, 1.2? Banger alert. I do like all the eyes and teeth scattered all over the place. It's funny to me. I played two who this is nothing. So could Ace of Diamonds these assholes just for kicks. But I think I think honestly at this point, we take Ace of Diamonds just to, like, get rid of a bunch of annoying enemies. Like, when he spawns a fuck ton of goons. And then, like, lasers come down. I think we save it for that. It has become a survival item rather than a money-getting item. Fuck. Smooth. Smooth can be devastating. It, it, like, there's always a safe place to stand. But... Finding that place can be tricky. I am not damaging the boss. These assholes. If he summons a bunch of them with the lasers, then I'll just use Ace of Diamonds to get him out of the way. Because I need to focus 100% on dodging the lasers. It might... One thing that's kind of fucked about this fight is, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think if you're at a certain speed, you can just literally not dodge the lasers. Survival. Survival. Prioritize survival. Over damaging the boss. Oh god. Now might even be a fun time to use the aces. Ace of diamonds. Ace of base. Oh. I have, like, the shield, too, I should, uh, remember. But a lot of times with those bullets that, like, go side to side, like, ee -mini -mini -mini, that it's no good. It's no bueno. Okay, see that? See that cool funny? Oh, I did bad. This is no bueno. I'm dead. Oh, man. So close, too. Thanks, Guppy's Collar. You're a real homie. I could theoretically still do it, but unlikely. Mm. So, like, that, those lasers... I'm right, right? Like, sometimes you just can't avoid them. It seems like when you're turning you, like, slow down or something, or they have, like, better tracking or some shit. It's very strange. 
Yeah, I'm afraid to use my shield on a lot of things that, like... Bullets that are not coming, like, straight at me. Which includes a lot of bullets in this fight. Like, Mega Satan, the shield is a lot more abusable on. Because, like, if it's at a wonky angle, bullets can very much curve around your shield. Okay, like, if I can make it to Void, then, uh... Then I think we're free. Like, that's just... that's just a win. Because Void, with, uh... With the full map, like, that's just... that's just a dub right there, like... you can just go straight to all the bosses that are not Delirium. I also kind of forgot that I can spam, uh... Like, I probably could have won that fight if I fucked my asshole. Uh... If I spammed my use item, I probably could have clutched it out. And I can kill these guys with it, too. Okay, please. Now I'm gonna shift to up. God damn it. Oh, and he shot that for like half a second just to jebate me. God damn. That is lame. Are there hearts anywhere? No. Okay. Just gotta do it damageless. It's pretty easy. See what I told you about Guppy's Collar? I told you, man. Let's, like, look around. I doubt this heart has spawned anywhere. I think I, uh, you know, I stand by it 100%. Genesis kind of sucks, unless you have a terrible build, or one that is perfectly suited to Genesis. Somebody said that I, like, used it too early, and, like, that is a factor, too. But I, a lot of the reason why I was hesitant to use Genesis is just because it almost never ends up giving me a better build. Because I'll tell you what, a lot of times when you're doing so well that you're, like, getting a bunch of angel rooms and getting Genesis, you don't need it. <laughs> you have a good build already. But it is, it's a safer bet way later on when you have like a fuck ton of items and then you can kind of just make a crazy custom build. But again, when you're way later on, a lot of times you don't need a better build. It's just kind of humorous. This guy, Hush's Continuum Tears move has always been my bane for this fight. Like it's always the worst part. I'm just fucking around at this point. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, I got the funny penny and tech. Okay. That's... that's humorous. Already off to a good start. Now this is a good item. Oh, the diaper? That's a great item. Gamer diaper acquired. Mom's bra? Very cool. We can turn that into a coin in a little bit. 
But of course, Bredmond will ordain that, uh, that we should just, you know, double it. I wonder if there's a mod for, like, randomizing what ending you're going for. You know? That, like, gives you... I don't know, they... If they enforced it, that would maybe make it, like, easier. It would be, like, a daily run, but... Destination indicator, okay. I'm not surprised. Good. Okay. Hollow. Uh... Thank you. Oh, two counts toward the mother transformation, though? Yeah. Maybe we can make it three. Maybe we can make it three. Uh. No, I don't think we're gonna have enough charge on this floor. Unless I get something crazy random lucky. That would be kind of funny, though. Watch out, it's the Duke of Flies. Oh, he's dead. Okay, speed up. You know, I'm not gonna bitch about that after last run. Okay, oh, thank God I can move in the Binding of Isaac. Holy shit. Never thought I'd see the day. Let's get the sack. That was a good trade. Three coins for a key and two bombs. Yeah. Labamba. Good. Very good. Hot damn. I think I'll even check for super secret. Uh. Oh god. Is it in the starting room? No, it's furthest away possible from the starting room, so it's gotta be on that right wall. Anger. Okay, whatever. This is fine. It's better than nothing. Oh, yay! Uh, oh, what's in the shop? I have 20 cents now. 15 cents! I'll take that! Oh, and the, there's a battery here, too. We gotta. It's funny. It's funny. Woo! <laughs> Mother transformation off of the same item repeated three times. Uh, now... Like, obviously, it does it for Mom's bra. Obviously. Man, if I could re-roll these... It'd be crazy. But I can't. I, I, don't, I don't know why you guys are surprised. That's how the video game The Binding of Isaac works. RNG will never go in your favor. It will only go in your favor when you absolutely do not need it. Fuck the knife! The knife got him. He, like, jumped in a perfect way to scrape my knife. I should have used them all just to feel something. Oh my god. Huge missed opportunity. This is a hilarious item, and you always take it. Fucking riot of an item. Uh, this is not a thing, but might as well. <clears throat> Why we got, like, both dookie-ass trinkets? Honestly, Funny Penny with battery at the very beginning is an interesting run. I, you know, Eden is such a fun character, even though a lot of times you'll get like, trash builds at the very beginning, and then you just feel like you're fucked. It's 
will be quite fun. Uh, that's fine. I've never really got a ton of use out of Bloody Gust, but as my one of my first items, it might be good. And if, if an item doesn't stack on itself, then we're not trying to double it. Plain and simple. Like, maybe I'll try to get transformations, that's it. Uh, I should have used that, whatever. Ah, uh, having infinite range against these fuckers is nice. In fact, if we get shops with, uh... Oh, look at that Incubus shopkeep, that's funny. And perfect place for the hole to be, goddamn. It's kind of a weirdly placed secret room. So I should try, like, duping this. No, only if there's a reroll machine in the store. You should try, you should, like, try to dupe things as many times as you can, and then reroll. But, of course, that's not, not gonna work out the way I want it to because of luck, but it could. It is a possibility. I'm finding it really difficult to aim the laser right now, actually. I need, like, a higher tier rate. Because the, the laser, like, angles when you move around. Which angers me. Oh! If I got hit in this room, maybe I could have, uh... I might as well. Coin. I could have blown up the, the Dwayne. The laser fire rate is also just barely too slow to be with the tempo of this music, which also angers me. Now, huge brain play is using Crooked Penny on one coin, because what's the worst that's going to happen? You get one coin? Think about it. Think about it. Oh! I forgot this one did that. Okay. There were a lot of hits that just felt like they weren't registering in that fight. I guess it's just laser jank. Uh... Gator brain. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's just go. I don't think there's really even anything to dupe. I could go in the uh, devil room and try to dupe it. <sighs> oh... <sighs> do it. Do it. If I get a third, do it in the next two seconds, then... I okay, I got, a third, I got a third, do it. <sighs> Woo! Free items. Boggers. Uh, these are all pretty good. Man, imagine if I got more charge. Uh, okay. That's cool. Uh, Monster Manuel, just a bookworm charge, I hate to say it. God, I got shade from that. We're, we're gonna keep, we're gonna keep the penny, guys. There's no way we're not keeping the penny. Oh, by the way, free penny. Okay. And we didn't fuck up our angel chance doing that, so that's nice. Okay, let's just go. How are we doing for time? I'm still, I'm on the fence if I want to even go for hush again. Last time I just got burnt by sort of unrelated things. Okay, I'm not gonna waste... If I didn't have the battery, I would've just used the Crooked Penny there for funnies, but... Since we have battery, I'm gonna keep it. Oh my god, yes. These ghosts are gonna be so good without much damage. Thoughts on the Breaking Bad finale? Isabel showed me a, uh, a list of, like, the highest... Oh, wait. Oh, you're fucking kidding me! Okay. I didn't notice those extra platforms. I thought I was being big brain. Just do it two more. Just do it one more time. And you'll get one golden chest. Uh... She was showing me a list of, like, the most highly rated episodes of TV ever aired. And one of them was, like, Ozymandias, and one of them was an episode of Bluey. 
Uh, you know what? Fuck Hush. I like playing slow. Let's just go for, like, Mega Satan or something. I don't know. Let's just play the game. I don't even care about what ending I get. And hey, it was a really good episode of Bluey, so, you know. Oh, haunted chest. Uh. Let's just see how this looks. Oh, no thanks. I'll be missing a lot more there. Although I'm sure it would help in, uh, in a way. Oh god, wait. Right after this room, I'm gonna go do the funny golden chest thing. God, that item is so cool when you... It, a lot of times, this little, like, ghost... floor ghost item... is, uh... not amazing. Cool. Didn't land on that one below. That's interesting. Ooh! That's hot. Now I double them. No. Now I double those chests... again! <laughs> and I got... what?! Oh my god! I hit- I forgot that it gives you a trinket, and I instantly doubled the trinket. That's so funny. Moldy bread! I just got four uh, pedestal items from this room. What? Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm not trying to, like, zerk my own dirk in here, but I feel like my Isaac runs, and I'm... I'm really sorry, because it's a very, like, pompous thing to say. I feel like my Isaac runs lately have just been banger after banger, just in terms of, like... Like, last one wasn't amazing, but just, like, entertaining. I am... It, I myself am marveling at the luck that I've had. It's, it's not me trying to, like, zerk myself off. Oh. Bloody Gust, though. Bloody Gust is helping out. Does that mean the original chest also contains items? That would be the case in... Uh, Afterbirth Plus, but it is not the case in Repentance. They, they changed that in Repentance. It used to be that when you duplicated a chest, if it had an active item in it, then the duplicate one would also have an active item. But they removed that, which is kind of a blessing and a curse. It's a good and bad thing, depending on the situation. Is the game volume okay? Like, it seems like like the laser is always such a loud weapon. I'm always like, am I shouting over the game? I should have picked up the penny before doing that. Like, I know I joked about it earlier, but it's actually a bad play. I thought it was the other way around. I thought it was still the same. I could be wrong on that. I could have sworn... Because I remember very specifically when I was making my How to Break the Binding of Isaac video, that was before Repentance came out, and I remember having a whole section in that video explaining how chests worked, how duplicating chests worked. Is all. And I remember very specifically, like, labbing it out and, like, not labbing it out, but, like, looking back through, like, old footage and shit. Shot speed down. Huge L. Oh my god. That's a run, Ruiner. That's... That's it. Await oh, my shots travel at the speed of light, Lamau. <laughs> okay, we are doing funny Crooked Penny plays, but I can't resist. What mods are you playing? I, really, just a couple of quality of life things. I still might check out Fiend Folio eventually, but not likely. <laughs> oh, I thought it spawned a second coin in there. I, you know what? I am actually going to get that because I'm crazy. That was stupid. I don't know why I did that. Oh, 
Oh, oh, kill, kill, kill. Yes. Killing it only gave me one penny. One extra penny. Weird. My speed is so good. Okay, my tears are at the cap now. Oh, we went above cap again. Because of... What exactly? Dolly? I don't know. What item do I have that goes above tear cap? Or is it just an Eden jank moment? What about the item room? I'm going back! Oh, he's not dead. Fuck. I'm going back. I'm going back for that and the shop. Uh, okay. And the curse room, actually. Ooh! Funny item! That'll leave me with two health. Uh, it drains all... Actually, it drains all of Isaac's red hearts. I thought it would leave me with one half a red heart and one half a soul heart. I'm gonna take this, because it's funny. Eight tears. How did that happen? Oh, bloody gust. That's funny. <laughs> Please nothing bullshit blow up in my face, please. Yeah, I'm not complaining about the eight tears. Hold on. We'll check for both at the same time. I'll do like, it'll, it'll be like one frame apart. Secret room check. I, what the fuck was that? Game, you dropped the ball. We don't dupe that. We don't dupe that. We don't dupe that. We don't dupe that. No. We take the sausage and we say thank you, Breadman, for the lovely meal. And you fucking eat your sausage like a good boy. Now this, this is some nice trash. It's actually not that bad, but... Keeping the funny penny. Let sausage. Oh god. Well, I lost my soul heart protection. It's not that big a deal because we still. It's it. The Blood oath doesn't just kill you for blood rights or whatever. God damn. That's one count toward the oh crap transformation, and uh, that's another count toward the oh crap tra transformation. Guys, it's a uh, it's another cat door, the oh crap transformation, and uh, we actually we actually got it. I didn't think that was gonna work. What does the oh crap transformation do? I think it makes it so when you blow up poops or when you destroy poops, it like heals you by a heart. Uh, I think we're taking both of these. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna take this. I'm sorry, I'm not being funny about that. Uh, cause I shit on member card, but seven cents, it's like, just take it. Okay, and member card is being its classic self. Actually, Pokego is not bad. Dupe here? Absolutely. Beautiful. Oh, that's hot. And we get a bone heart. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, it's a shame there's not more batteries on the room, or I could have tried to get conjoined there, too. Funny Penny Run is, uh, looking pretty good right now. Okay, go into the secret room, we do this. Flight. I'll take it. I love Transcendence, because it deletes half of your sprite. And it's just, that's funny to me. I kinda, in a way, it kinda bugs me the way that Isaac's appearance gets, like, all fucked up over the course of the game. So having, if, if there was an item that just made you, like, a solid black, like, painted Judas outline or something. I would love that. Speed up. I'm sure there's a mod that might do that. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, we've got a real pausing Andy today. Pausing Andy. Okay, time to die. I'm just uh, in the habit of doing it because, uh... Oh, God! Ah! Stop! Why? Why is it infinite? Why is it infinite? Uh, 
I don't get it. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? What just happened? Edmund, you're killing me! Uh, like, huh? Oh, ah, <laughs> fuck. That was so fucked up. Blood Oath counts every heart as one hit. Oh, that is silly. That is so fucking silly. Okay, well, you know, that's Blood Oath. That's how the fucking item works. Holy shit. So many bombs. That was frightening. Hematemesis. Great. I should have used that in the curse room, but how would I have known? And now we have a distinctly, like, unfunny Eden build. I, I definitely 100 million percent thought that that was just the game was bugging out and was spawning infinite bombs. That's cool. What a great item. I'm literally going to like pray that I can reroll it somehow. Or I might actually just hold R until I get another funny start. Because I have 450 Eden tokens. I'm never going to run out. There's that. That was the first trinket we got last run too. I panicked. <sighs> Fucking two different funny items combining to create pure essence of comedy. Curse of the Tower and Blood Oath or Blood Rites or whatever the fuck. Of course, the, uh, the bombs weren't exactly why I died. They weren't the cause of death, but I, I think I can say they flustered me a bit. I think I can say I was somewhat flustered. Right, uh, th they buffed the hourglass to have only a room charge of two, right? Ow. I should have just used it right at the beginning. It lasts the whole room, right? Or does it just last? I thought it, I kind of thought it lasted a period of time. Yeah, okay, it does. Oh my God, euthanasia! That was that was insane. It hit his head. Pausing Andy. Pausing Andy. It hit his head, and then it, the shots that came off of his head killed him. World and the sun. That's kind of cool. Shame we're not going to get use out of one of them. I guess we'll just keep the sun. Because sun also gives you full map. Oh no, we can see secret room with this. That's fine. Look at this guy. I genuinely thought... Somebody said, oh, cute beggar shopkeeper. I genuinely thought this was just a beggar in the room. I didn't, like, look right at him. <laughs> what is this, like, creepy pasta shopkeep? He's got a nickel on him. That's guaranteed. What did I tell you? The fuck? Uh, okay. Thinking about buying that soul heart, but no. Uh, let's get the sack. The sack is always good. Okay, the sack is not always good. The three cent sack, on average, will be a benefit, though. Guess we're taking this, asshole. Uh. Yeah, fuck it. I don't know. Commit. I like doing the mother ending. It's one of the most exciting, fun routes. Okay, so the sun will be my panic card here. Oh god. I'm gonna really hope that nothing hits me for double damage. Until I get a heart. Eventual spirit is cool. 
not dissimilar to Bloody Gust. Okay, uh, Ouija board, I don't know. Man, I saw something on that. You guys, I, I, you recall how I told you that I've been hate reading the high strangeness subreddit posts recently? And like, fuck, like, yeah, I still go on Reddit occasionally. I don't know what to replace Reddit with. I don't really like it much either. But let's take the F. But it's like a, it's like a sub. Ooh, Scorpio is real cool. It's like a subreddit where people talk about, like, aliens and ghosts and shit. Or, like, conspiracy-type stuff. And, uh... Oh god, BBF triggers off of these guys. And and somebody... There, were, there was a post with, like, people going, like, Oh, you know... A bunch of kids passed out after using a Ouija board. And, uh... And, and some people in the comments were like, Oh, don't fuck around with Ouija boards. Tumblr, Tumblr, Tumblr. Huh. Cause yeah, I, yeah, exactly. Someone was like, forums don't exist anymore and Reddit is the closest thing to that. Yeah. Maybe Tumblr? Here's the thing. I always fucking despise navigating Tumblr. I can never find anything. Has that changed? Has it got to the point where you can like search a Tumblr and it'll show you that Tumblr or something? I don't even know. I don't remember the exact issues, but I remember it being a nightmare. Anyway, Ouija boards are bullshit and it's it's a Hasbro toy. And th th to anybody who somehow doesn't know the Ouija board thing, some people move the little thing with their hands. And since everybody's touching it, you can just sort of do that. You can just influence. It's like groupthink. So you can just make it say something spooky. Anybody unclear on that? It's not ghosts. It's a toy. I know it's like based on an older thing, but like the Ouija board as we know, it's not like a religious object. It is a product sold by Hasbro, who makes like fucking Candyland and shit. I, I, it's unbelievable to me that some people think Ouija boards are legit. But there's a lot of shit that I am surprised by people's belief in these days. And I'm not trying to be like an edgy atheist. I'm, it's not really what I'm talking about. Okay. Ouija is just mutual gaslighting. It sounds like a shitpost, but that's true. Ooh, okay. Uh, the, the chargedness of the key kind of jump scared me there. Here's the secret. Oh, shit! Sackhead is cool. Sorry, pausing Andy, pausing Andy. Look at the inspector gadget. Brown bricks looking ass shopkeep. Looks at Scientology lol. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, the path of the cringe, the path of the kick. Oh, I get both of them? Excuse? I thought it was a choice. God damn, that is a rare secret room. Kek and cringe, yin and yang, living as one. That is, I don't know if I've ever seen that secret room. Okay. Uh, we got five bombs. It's never a choice. It's never two items. I, I just was not used to that. Okay. <laughs> uh, I like that guy. Okay. YouTuber secret room. Whoa. Is the music like fucked up or is that how it always sounds? The sun. Didn't really get a lot of hearts that floor, so we're just gonna do that. 
yeah, I don't know, you can believe whatever you want to believe, but certain things, I just... I just, they just annoy me. Like a lot of conspiracy stuff. And it's hard to lump it all together in the same group, but uh, frankly, a lot of conspiracy stuff is just kind of dumb. And is in the same vein of, like, thing that there is not a ton of public knowledge about. Like, unified public knowledge about. Leads to tons of speculation. Is this bait? Oh, I see. Or, like, poor quality photograph leads to tons of room for interpretation. That's, like, 90% of, like, paranormal shit. That people try to, like, open quotes, document. It's still documentation, it's just documenting bullshit. Whatever. Uh, I'm gonna be funny. Samson's Chains, just another opportunity to take random damage, just like BBF. What is this, like, bomb wisp that I have? That's not a Mama Mega one, is it? God, and like, so many of the things on the High Strangeness subreddit are first-hand accounts, which, I'm sorry to ruin the magic for anybody, again, but sometimes people just tell horse shit. Sometimes people just lie, like, actually quite frequently, in this lovely world of ours. I'm sounding like a real, like, asshole this stream, but... I don't, there's not a but to that sentence, I'm sounding like a real asshole this stream. We get the perfume, I think. Uh, and I'm just trying to think if we want to get that sack, but probably not. We're, we're fine. We're doing good on everything. It is illegal to lie on the internet. Ugh. Sorry, no, that's more like... <laughs> there we go. I'm not gonna take that heart. Uh, where was the white fire? It was, like, right around here, right? Yeah. I should go see what the boss is. Fuck. Whatever. I'm gonna fight the boss anyway. Oh my god, it's really far away. I regret everything. I could just not do it, but we're gonna have to go most of the way there anyway. In order to get the key piece, or the knife piece. Oh yeah, and flying with Samson's chains. That's kinda cool. It's kinda fogged out. Oh, God, what a good drop! Knife piece one! Ah! Not having to worry about the water in this room is amazing. Because these these are some of the most annoying things in uh, Repentance are these rooms with the running water. Ah, there's going to be a crawl space and you're all going to cry. Rocks, crawl space. This is worth it. <clears throat> this is worth it. Samson's Chains does actually guarantee a crawl space on every floor. Now, you very well could be joking. I have frequently made the guaranteed crawl space joke. But, uh... On the off chance that you are not joking, it's actually a common misconception that... that... that there is a guaranteed crawl space under some rock every floor. That's what I've heard. That's not true, though. Okay. 
I don't think that Samson's Chains breaks the mirror. Could be wrong. But, uh... That could have killed me. That, if I had been unlucky there, that could have very well killed me. Oh god, it was a gold troll bomb. It was a Mama Mega Wisp. That's funny. Well, you know what? We can get the secret room with this. Oh, come on, move! Just, just go over there, champ. Nah, no, just go over there, mate. Nah, no, mate, just go over there. Yes, now my sweet reward! A nickel. Fuck you. So much wasted time. Okay, this guy's easy. I think. I hope. BBF, don't fuck me. Ooh. Very cool. Very cool item. <sighs> I have mantle. <laughs> Just do that. This is the one, baby. Man, one of these days, it's actually gonna be, like, I'm gonna go to, go to some ridiculous distance to, like, get the last rock on the floor. And then there's actually gonna be a crawl space and you guys are gonna scream. Okay, now to break all of these. Oh, I can't walk. I can't fly. Fuck that. I can still technically break them, but fuck that. Okay, I shouldn't need the slowdown on this guy. BBF's got my back. One of the best items in the goddamn game. Hey, that's whatever. I'm gonna go for Angel. I'm sad about that Crooked Penny run, but I, like... We had Crooked Penny, Curse of the Tower, and the thing that stabs you at the beginning of the floor. Blood Oath or Blood Rites. It was- it was destined to be a funny shitpost run. Okay. Oh god. I think we established that crawl spaces can spawn in these rooms, right? Why would I break these rocks and not the rest of them on the floor? Because the fires have one coin and one half a heart in them. There's the coin. There's the half heart. Fuck you. I'm done. Fuck you, I'm done. Cry about it. It was exactly a coin and half a heart, by the way. Exactly, precisely, just that exact thing that I said. Ouija board. Used a Ouija board. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> He tried the seed before the stream. Seed of, of my, like, third run. I've never seen this room before, that's cool. Genuinely, it is cool. <sighs> oh, that's a hurt door, fuck. It was so dark. Speed down, Pog. Oh wait, there's another pill. Thing we got that. Uh, sorry, there's another pill. Health, Health down. down. Hmm. Ooh, panic button actually is not terrible. <laughs> well, there it goes. Actually, did I even take damage? Did I take damage and then like instantly pick up a heart or something? What was that? This is one of the rare spacebar items that the thing is actually kind of good on, that trinket. But 
is it better than counterfeit penny? I, I think I pressed space too, but I didn't think I did that. Ooh. Yeah. More happy about the five bombs than I am the, uh... poisonness of them okay well uh you know i uh well i gotta help down and that's just the facts and you can't go back in time unless i crash the game intentionally i remember speaking of flash isaac for the longest time i like never even oh why did i do that both i'm an idiot whatever it still was fine the order i did it is it always the same one in that room, I wonder? Or maybe there's two... I bet how they do it is there's two rooms that are just like this, but with equal, like, room weight. And one of them has it up in the top left, and one of them has it in the bottom right. I bet that's how they do it in the game, in the code. Game Design Andy. For the longest time with Hematemesis, I just never even tried to think about what that word was <laughs> until I, like, until Rebirth added the voices that, like, say Hematemesis. I just, like, didn't- my brain just, like, rejected the word. Ooh. Is that sticky? No. Let's just break this guy with the chain. That's cool. I'll take that right now. If I had more health, if I even had one more heart container, I would hang on to it, but I'm taking it. What? what the fuck was this room? Huh? Yeah, there was no threat? <laughs> and it was like the easy, it was not even a puzzle, it was just hit the buttons? That felt like a test room, please ignore. I wonder if slowing these guys down slows down the timer for them getting back up. I bet it does. Uh... Hematemesis at one heart is also just a quick heal, which is nice. Oh, another magician. You shouldn't have. Uh, okay. We got a lot of money. Counterfeit penny, good. It's just magician. Oh god. I struggle with this boss because uh, I'm least familiar with its patterns. That's my excuse going forward. I think my homing tears are homing onto his like scapegoat guys too, which sucks. Okay. Come on. Die, 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 die. It's a really cool boss idea, it's just hard. Yeah, this is the unused boss. They, like, patched it into the game. It's fucking awesome. That's a conjoined count right there. Bella has taught me that uh, familiars have... She literally was, like, doing it as a shitpost, and then it actually be ended up becoming a real lesson that you should get familiars, even if they seem like they're gonna be bad. Because, uh, conjoined happens so frequently if you do that. Oh, no. I, I, I panicked and used my, uh, magician there just because I wanted to make room for the hematemesis. But there's also just hearts lying around. But having a hematemesis in a room with danger is particularly pogged. Familiars on their own without the whole conjoined thing are not always, like, let's keep it real here, they're not always very good. Some of them are great, of course, but a lot of them late game really struggle to keep up with the damage output, I find. Damage output, Andy. A thoughtful shopkeep. Well, we're taking that, that's for sure. We're taking the soul heart. We're taking a lot of this. So, I'm just gonna use two of clubs, I think. 
because I want to keep Hematemesis. Okay, I was really hoping that one would just casually be the crawl space, but no. I think the thing that people get confused on, whoa, with, uh, with crawl spaces, saying that there's like guaranteed one under a rock in every floor, there's, there's one like shared crawl space for every floor. So even if you, you can find multiple crawl space openings, but they will all lead to the same place. Okay, I can go get this half a heart now. I can get both of these. Ooh. Whoa, what the fuck? Um... Do I have an invisible incubus right now? I'm sorry? What is happening? Rubber cement. It was confusing me because it was like stopping. That, okay, that, no, that's like jank. It's bouncing off like the edge of the wall? I don't even know. Not even, not even that. Uh, rebounding off the level boundary, sure. I don't know. Look how many trinkets there are. What the fuck? Okay, we don't want that. We don't want that. We don't want that. Funny, but we don't want it. God damn. Yeah, I should have just, to be perfectly optimal, I should have. Or maybe I opened the shop with the golden key anyway. Should have picked that up before I went in the shop. Whatever. Okay, we're done. We're going Mega Satan. I, I want Mega Satan. I have decided. Ooh! Uh, oh, but what about the secret rooms? We have oh so many bombs that I don't even feel the need to check all the walls. Shit. Mistake. Okay, that's that's an HP up. That's huge. That is enormous. I don't think I actually bombed there before. Hmm. This was the starting room, right? I think. Let's try up here. Boom. Oh, and now we can fly and drag over these, too. That's amazing. Okay. Damn, good floor. Good fucking floor. Oh, wait, is there a coin that was out of reach here? Hell yeah. Yeah, let's, let's leave. So I have, like, stompy light right now. Why am I doing that? <laughs> I just narrowly avoid. Uh, drag your ball over jagged rocks. Just to hear some girl shit through a walkie-talkie. Not very useful. We do... Oh, this was not the run where we had a syringe. Okay, we lost some tears. We got some damage. Lost speed. I keep going slow. And there was a speed down pill earlier, too. No, take the hematemesis, because now I have more health. Beautiful. I was like, I can't use these hematemesis pills efficiently. Uh -huh. just bomb my way into the door there since I'm flying. Is that like a known fact that you can do that? Really 
glad that mushroom did not poop on me. Because I decided I just did not care about being careful there. Uh, okay. Stars, we have not been to the... Uh, of course, my temptation is to go to... Uh, you know, that experimental treatment really wasn't half bad. The speed is the only bad thing. I want to go to the boss challenge room. And then stars out of it, potentially. But even then, the stars is just like a, an insurance against if you find something really bad or like something that won't help you survive inside there. Because a lot of times, the boss challenge room, you'll get like a space or a, not a space item, like a health item that'll make it easier to survive. Ooh, what a cool trinket. The only thing is my soul hearts. I would want to get rid of them on something worthy. I don't even really care about, like, spending the key right now. To get into the shop, or into the treasure room, rather. We don't want piercing shots, because then we don't really get the bouncing tears benefit. But! Oh! Does piercing tears make it so that your lost contact shots that don't block bullets, or that do block bullets, don't get deleted? Am I right in remembering that? Is that how that works? Because I might... That is how it works. Cool. Take it. It's a weird... It's a weird take, but it's a good take, I think. Oh, yeah. Conjoined. Black Bean is genuinely a bad item. Actually, didn't they buff it? Yeah, they did. Let's take it. Just to see the new effect, because I've never actually seen it. Uh, friend finder, no. Three cent sack, I'll take that. Sand flies, oh my god. Bella keeps saying, 14 cents, I'll take that to me, and it drives me fucking mental. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like losing my mind. <laughs> I'm like, stop. Ah! It's a funny room. It pranked me. Ooh. Hang on to that, too. Okay. Uh, that's the stars taking Wheel of Fortune. You hear those dogs? They're barking. Uh, maybe do the boss before we do this. Hey, how about... Just lose a bunch of health while on the escape sequence. Or to these assholes. The, s the slowdown is actually really good for these guys. Oh, BBF just KO'd one of them instantly. That's awesome. I actually really struggle to hit these guys with the bombs consistently. Okay, I guess... Yeah, sure. That's fine. I've actually got two counts toward fun guy. I'm, I'm being a real transformation Andy this stream. It was funny describing what sandflies was, because she was like, what, what do people keep saying sandflies? And I'm like, oh yeah, I just screamed really loud. That's it. <laughs> she was like, oh. I consider myself pretty good at this part, honestly. Like, I take damage here and there, but... I've mostly got it down to a science. Some rooms can be brutal. But, uh... Oh god. Oop. Oh! Like, when that happens, you just sit still... ...and wait for it to start up a charge again. Very nice. Oh, what? I, like, looked at chat because I didn't realize there was a rock in the way. And I just, like, slammed my gun into it. Okay, well, you know what? We're losing the perfect amount of health here. This is exactly what I wanted. 
Uh, I freak, is this like a winged man or a hanged man? I think it is, yeah. It's kind of funny. You don't actually need it to complete this room. You can get free money off this part. Health! Haha! Now I'll use it on this room. Very tricky. Okay. Oh, but there's not a blood donation machine. For some reason, my dumbass thought there was a blood donation machine on the floor. I'm still gonna have to hurt myself a few times. And there's no sack room. It fucking sucks. I wish Dark Bum could just punch me and just take my health. So we got, my logic here is we've got fucking Rosary right here, which yeah, it does the Bible thing, but I will just cope with it. Just get the Bible and deal with it. And we've got a bunch of hearts lying around, so I might as well do this. Uh, let's just go through the curse room. No, uh, God, this is a desperate, you guys just know that I, I love to be as efficient as possible in these games. So even with dumb shit like this, where it's like, I'm trying to lose health deliberately. It's like, oh, I'll go do a bunch of risky things that I didn't, I didn't want to commit to before. One percent, one percent planetarium Bible. Oh, and we have the hematemesis too. That's my real, that's the thing I'm actually bringing into the fucking I could bring Cursed Penny too, maybe, but I don't know if a coin would spawn. It's usually a pedestal item. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Let's see. Trapdoors can spawn in the escape. We've seen it happen before. Uh, hold on. Where is the secret room on this floor? Let's just check, we got so many bombs. <laughs> it could be there. It's kind of an obnoxious spot for it. Um, <laughs> it's a fucking potato mine. It's a spadow. That's so cute. <laughs> now we gotta blow it up. Oh, tee -hee. It's a little bomb, oh, it'll blow up. <laughs> Boom! He's dead. <laughs> Sorry, I like probably jump scared someone uh no actually stars is more efficient i can't believe i just like I, 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 stop screaming he's farming for sand flies stars is the more efficient thing here because it lets me keep the hematemesis and use the health that's just laying around on the floor so we're doing this we're doing this dumb thing no, the imitator was a different thing. Oh my god, look at the braps. That's unbelievable. Okay, oh my god. It's a count toward the oh crap transformation. Yeah, fuck this. I'm not, I'm not waiting to see that room reward. That's not worth it. Fuck that guy. Okay, and we still got stuff to do here. I'm gonna go ahead and... Bible. Bible. I didn't even see what the first thing was. I, like, perfectly skipped it. Pick it up just for, uh, <laughs> Seraphim, which I think just gives me flight. It would also get it out of the pool, is the thing. <sighs> right? Like, it, that would remove it from the pool, right? I'm, I'm actually gonna do it. Just for funnies. Transformation Andy. Oh, it gives you soul hearts. I forgot about that. Worth 15 cents, two soul hearts. I'll take that. Sand flies. Ba -da -ba -put -up. I'm just saying it over and over. I'm trying to like desensitize everyone now. So, I'm sorry, in here is just Bible, in here is this. We want that. And I think we're keeping hematemesis.
I should change my name to Silly Fruit. Yes. Very silly. Uh, okay. Oh, and we're, we gotta go in the fucking hurdy door, too. Almost missed that. Right? I'm doing it anyway. God. They buffed the shit out of Black Bean. It's weird. I always watch the, the like, interlevel cutscene just long enough that I, uh see which cutscene it is, but then I don't actually watch the whole thing. I'm just like the mildest bit curious which one it is. What if there's like some hyper rare one, right, that nobody's ever seen before? Oh, I hit a button that killed them all. I was like, what just deleted all of them? I didn't even mean to hit that button. I mean, I knew that was there. This was not the best. Could could have done without those troll bombs. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, I'm gonna use stars on the curse room. There could be another red sword room in this floor, but I don't think there will be. Isn't it like red sword rooms are more likely to appear when you're at lower health when you enter a floor? Or something? Backstabber. Didn't this get, uh buffed, or am I thinking of betrayal? Hitting an enemy in the back deals double damage, it causes bleeding, which makes enemies leave creep and take damage when they move. I think I still want to take the other thing. Backstabber is good. Could be funny. Both got buffed. Huh. Okay. I took this item this stream? Yeah, but not when it was, like, a choice, I'm pretty sure. That's why I was, like, thinking about it more. I, I gotta admit, a lot of Isaac, I am on autopilot. This is a game I play to just, like, chill. Because it's so... I'm so familiar with most of it. As you can see, not all of it, but... A lot of times, I just kind of am on autopilot. Oh, that sucks. I've never seen that happen. The golden penny turned into a sack because of sack boy. What a silly game. Always surprising me with new silly things. Okay, I think... Yeah, for some reason I thought there was a card left in there. Uh... So this will be an actual mausoleum boss. Not dad's note. I'm gonna keep the coin. I, I love counterfeit penny too much. <laughs> that guy was hearing penis music. Stop the penis music. Get out of my head! Ooh, a lot of money. That a sticky? That is a sticky. We've already... No, we've not gone to the shop. The hermit. Very cool. That's conjoined. That is conjoined, baby. Woohoo! We'll grab that, too. Death. Oh, that one's like a single-use Book of the Dead, right? Sure. I should just donate the rest of these, because we're not going to see much else used for money. Oh, I got hit twice by that. Wow, crawl space. Very cool. Finally. Was there another golden coin up there too? Damn. Perfectly equipped with the conjoined and the angle there. Oh my god. Another count with the mother transformation. The fuck? And turned into a sack again. God damn. I feel like I was lucky to get as many coins as I did before when I was picking that other one up. Because Sackboy procs pretty often. Okay, uh... Fuck, I haven't been thinking about using the death card. Because you, you want to use it in a... 
You want to use it right after you've killed a bunch of enemies. What? Okay. I probably won't have a use for those, but my brain says leave them. There might be some crazy thing that a bunch of uh, battery charge would be great for later on. Oh, right. If you destroy the rock that those things are connected to, they just roll around a bit. Uh, an uncommon interaction. Okay, we do have a sack room here, but I don't really want to use it. What even hit me? One of the guy's whips? I'm gonna bomb this, because it's gonna be... I can just lure this thing over here. Okay. Uh, fuck it, just use death right now, I don't even care. It's not like I need them, we've got a pretty good build. Not terribly funny, though. I think we were held back by a, a cringe starting item. I should have brought the magician in here. Oh! Dodged that move, I think, for the first time in my life. Where it, like, puts a hook into you, and, like, drags you toward it. Oh god. Look at them all. I've never really got a super good look at that. Bunch of babies in there. Was creepier than one baby being in the back of the mask? Like 80. I always heard that that was a Castlevania reference. We're at tier cap, by the way. That there was like, Edmund McMillan like said in an interview somewhere or something that the mask having a thing inside of it was a Castlevania reference. I don't know what, I need to play every Castlevania game so I figure out what that's a reference to. <gasps> Two out of three on oh crap. Oh, BBF blew up one of the fires too, that's clutch. Uh... Ooh. We have one more treasure room, right? And the penny is not really doing much for me anymore. Perfume breaks tear cap. What would I do without you guys? Live. A good life. A better life. Alright, I got two cards from that? Uh, another magician. Is there? Oh, there's a sticky nickel in here, right? Okay, so, uh... The chariot. I'm just seeing what the best thing is. I think we're bringing... The fucking hanged man? The no. Hanged man. Why, did I think that was another magician? I'm, like, going cuckoo bananas. We have to go to Kukumo. Metamesis is no longer that helpful. I could go crazy on the, uh... Oh! oh. Yeah. We do this. We do this. We do this. And then we get 30 coins. Emperor. Bobby bomb? Cool, I've got homing poison bombs now. That's fine. Not the best thing, but something. If you have a key piece... Uh... I'm gonna go grab some hearts. No. It's 30 coins. Fuck me. Well, you know, we got some sacks out of that. I don't even feel the need to pick up the counterfeit penny. Like, we're not gonna spend all this money. Yeah, I've often thought, why isn't there a bomb transformation? It's kind of silly. Like, there's some items, like the oh crap set, that you would never think to, like, categorize for a transformation like that. And then there's stuff that seems like a no-brainer that is not. 
included. Okay, well, we did not get the soul hearts. Uh, rip. Okay. I think we're done. Should I donate? No. My, my donation machine is like the fucking... I, I'm sure, I think I've probably seen this done with Isaac. The like... The farmer who's like walking up with like... I think it's actually Obama. It's like a political cartoon. The farmer walking up with like a fuck ton of buckets to a really skinny ass cow. That's me with my donation machine. Uh... It's not got a lot in it anymore. Yeah, the Bob transformation. Yeah. That was the case with spider items for a long time. Yeah. That's true. Are, are you saying they didn't have a transformation, or are you saying there were not enough spider items and then they added more? Troll bomb. Poggers. I thought maybe there was a button. Okay, well, that's interesting, having all those hearts there. Uh, the game is tempting me. Satan himself reaches through the game. I already have conjoined. You're of no use to me, Harlequin baby. Please just make a path. It's like a more complicated way of making you pay a fucking bomb. Ball of tar, not bad at all. I like this item. It's a classic. I would consider this item to be a classic. Yeah, I don't even know if it was in OG Isaac. It might be a base rebirth item. Okay. Oh! Conjoined plus rubber tears is so good. It's so good. Now this is a funny item, although actually a lot of the funny items that it could roll into are not in the rotation. It's a bunch of like boring ones, right? Is it active item or passive item? Just random item effect, it must be passive item. Maybe it's any? Uh, <laughs> curse of the tower. <laughs> No thanks. Oh. Huge. Uh, do I need to hold on to this until I go in the treasure room? No, that I think actually we got that. The golden horseshoe did its job. It can proc Damocles, can it? it can be anything, huh? Uh, okay. Funny. Sounds funny to me. I've honestly not fucked around with metronome much. I just always see it when I have something much more, uh, solid. The hourglass is fine, but... I don't know if it's really what I want. Okay, this is mommy. Extra mom. So I'm gonna wait to fight. Oh, and we can do sack room and then go into that red sword room. That's perfect. I've still been playing card fight Vanguard. Now that we're, now that we're not doing a Celeste stream, any of you any of you viewers play card fight Vanguard? Oh, I shouldn't have gone in here. God damn it! I didn't realize I just picked up an Eternal Heart. Well, maybe the uh, metronome, good old metronome, will help. Oh. <laughs> well, that looks cool. It's bullet hell. This is a fucking Toho pattern right here, and then they go like that. Straight up just a bullet hell pattern. Like, slow it down a bit, you know? Uh, okay. Are we keeping- should I just use world right now? It give us the secret room, I think. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, sorry, eternal heart. I ruined it. Oh, health up! Uh, yeah, you know? It came back to, to touch us once again. 
I would have had to use it on the sacrifice room anyway. God, this one with the four scaredy hearts is so, like, rude. Because you just know the plan is, like, for you to, like, spawn an angel or, like, get the troll bomb layout. Or, the, not layout, the payout. Get the, like, guaranteed troll bombs, and then you're, like, running for this health. And then it runs away from you and you die. Right, it's good to get the extra angel chance possibilities before the boss. So it's good that we're doing this early. Full health. That's cool. That's mother. Oh, transformation! And that's another heart. Okay, moment of truth. We want soul hearts. We got soul hearts. Hell yeah. 50-50 to be soul hearts or coins. And that was... Oh! The perfect amount. Uh, yeah, sorry. I didn't look at the responses for uh, a bunch of people who have never heard of Card Fight Vanguard. A couple people are playing it. Yeah, I've been... I was talking about how my, like, Hexorb Sorceress deck is getting an update apparently, and it's uh, apparently like a few months down the line or something. But it's gonna basically catch up to like other decks, which is nice, because Isabel has just been I, repeatedly destroying me over and over again. Uh, we've been playing it recently. And part of it is because I'm fucking amateur hours at the game, but I feel like part of it is that the deck is just really behind the meta. From my exceptionally limited knowledge of the series. Uh, but it's like an anime card game. I don't know. Similar to like... I've also... Okay, here's another one. That I... Both of these I had never heard of before I met Bella. Uh, Weiss Schwartz. Or Weiss Schwartz or whatever. I don't know how you're supposed to say it. I always say it really fast so I don't have to think about how to say it. Oh, I forgot to go in here. Uh, what is this item? I forgot. It's the hourglass that I ditched, right? And we could get Curse of the Tower! <laughs> I don't even know what Metronome did. Anybody notice? Uh, okay, and we're keeping this trinket even though there's some to gulp there. We got our soul hearts. I'm just gonna go. I do have Bobby Poison Bombs, oh my god. Yeah, you've actually convinced me. That's like Bobby Bombs plus uh, Curse of the Tower is an insane combination. We've had it before here. Oh, Void Portal. Very interesting. Should we hold a vote? Cause like I already did all this to like get the the knife. Let me pick it up. <laughs> like the wow of the void portal is uh, confusing my hitbox knowledge. <laughs> now that you like card games, you should play Joustus and Shovel Knight. I don't know about that. We'll see. Uh. And I also have the Mega Satan key. God damn. Uh, you know, yeah, I, I get the point of, like, go Mega Satan. Because then Mega Satan, we can see more of the game, and there's still quite a few possibilities that we can get Void. I like that. I like that. Everyone else dispensing opinions right now, get fucked. I, I like that idea. Because Mega Satan is fine, and then if we get Delirium, it's like a nice little extra treat. Mega Satan for transformation, Andy. Oh, that one black fly, that is one of the most devastating rooms in the womb. One of the worst shops in the Citadel. Fuck it, whatever. Any any tips to clear up acne? 
King. Uh, I I have I I'm very sorry to disappoint. I have nothing for you. I, by the way, the metronome hurt me. I think. I never I never had to deal with acne. I honestly and like. Man, I ate a lot of pizza and stuff. I always heard like, oh, like greasy foods are like your worst nightmare with acne. But I, I'm very sorry to say, and I'm, you know, this is like, this is like, like I, I have allergies and shit, but like, this is something I actually get to be privileged about is I, I never had to deal with acne. I was always very thankful. I guess I just had the like genetics for it or whatever. And my sister got it like a, a pretty normal amount. But I, I just never did for whatever reason. I like watching the eyes slide across the floor. Right, we got double damage Andy in here in the womb. And, and oh yeah, and that's another thing. I I touch my face all the time. I constantly Constantly, I'm touching my face. Uh, I'm touching my face right now and playing this with my feet. No way I'm doing this thing in the middle. I, I bet a bunch of people just went like, no, please, no. <laughs> when they saw that guy in the middle in my 82 coins. Uh, you know, my when I was like in high school, I... My, like, deranged adolescent brain was like, Yeah, the reason I don't get acne is probably because other people are just trying too hard to get rid of acne. That was my- that was my take as a kid, or as a teenager. I never said it- I never said this to anybody. Now I'm willing to admit this weird take. Now that I've grown past it, but... I was always like, yeah, they're like fighting- they're like fighting too hard for it. And if they just- if they just eased up like I ease up and never fucking wash my face. I mean, I showered, but I never really washed my face that much. I was like, oh, if they just ease up, then they won't get acne. That is very much not the case. Uh... I mean, someone said true, actually. I mean, it, there might be an, an element of truth to it in some, like, technical way, but I think overall, a lot of people just get, like, fucked acne. Just from, like, genetics. Like, I- I think we all knew somebody in high school, and maybe, perhaps you are this person, who, like, some people just have devastating acne that just, like, covers their entire face, you know? I, I don't think those people really have much choice in the matter. Stress? Here's another thing, I'm super stressed out. I literally just think I got luck lucky genetics. Actually, you know, now that I'm really thinking about it, I was a pretty relaxed teenager. Like, school itself was stressful to me, but I feel like I got- I got pretty, uh, pretty zen. We have a lot of familiars, but I still haven't swallowed this trinket. Uh, oh, someone said my face is spotless, but my back is a problem. Um, my ass gets acne. I get acne on my butt, and I hate it, because my butt looks gross, because it's all, like, scarred up and constantly has, like, acne on it. Like, not, like... I don't even know, it, it, it might be not actually acne. No, it's like, it's like, I'll tell you what it is. It's like, every once in a while, I get, like, one extremely painful, extremely large pimple on my ass. It's not like I'm covered in it. But I'm scarred from every once in a while, getting one huge, and like, if you touch it, you'll go like, FUCK! Like, really painful. Same. Ingrown hair? Possibly. Someone said same. My brother. I get that too, right? I, I think, I think other people, are you with me here? I think I'm not the only one. It might be an ingrown hair, I don't know. It really, like... It's like, fucked up. It's, it's like, I swear it's a zit, not an ingrown hair. Cause like, I've got ingrown hairs, but they... 
they don't feel like that. Maybe it's just that there's a lot of nerve endings in your ass? I don't know. This has been a conversation. But right here. This guy's like, oh. He's no, he's like the, supposed to be like the the like 2011 meme rage comic like angry face, but with like sad and confused rather than angry. This one's really cool. Uh, I'm totally gonna end up like just bringing this 48 hour energy into uh, the final boss fight and just spamming metronome to see what I get. Okay, oh, I have fast travel, but one more thing. Mm. This, I guarantee 100%. Fuck. I'll do it, I'll give 50 Twitch subs. Oh. No, right? Like, that's, this is stupid. Pay out once and then go away. Like, they can give you pedestal items, but it's very rare. And I don't feel like sitting here for like an hour. Okay, uh, yeah, I guess when I took... When I took the negative, I was kind of thinking that I was going to do... The Void Portal. So, oops. Convince me to play. You convinced me to play Pizza Tower, and it was great. Well, that's uh, that's awesome. I'm paraphrasing there, but very cool. And I, that is a very gratifying feeling to me. Very like uh, any y'all ever play the Beginner's Guide? It's like that unhealthy gratification where I feel like, oh yeah, like I'm the Pizza Tower guy. But in reality, the Pizza Tower guy is the Pizza Tower guy. I'm just some asshole who played it really early. I'm the, I'm the asshole who broke Embargo. Yep. Actually, fuck, am I on the womb? No. I'm on the... I'm worse. I don't think a shop spawns in this floor, right? Whatever, there's still possible things that I could get a discount on. Just... That can happen infinitely, by the way. It, it literally... I've seen people, like, mod the game so that they just removed the, like, random chance. Like, they, they made it so that was the only thing that had a chance of spawning. And it can just happen infinitely. Like, like with... Okay, that made it sound like they modded it for it to happen infinitely, but, like... If you got insane luck, you could get a chain of, like, 50 of those chests getting smaller and yes. smaller. It's all just luck. It's theoretically infinite, but it'll never actually happen, probably. Well, no, it'll never happen, because they would have to count to infinity. And that's a really big number. Just kind of wanted to see how that looks. Now my bullet hell pattern got a little harder. It's dumb how holy and dark crown are separate trinkets. Yeah, it's kind of true. I never really thought about that. Uh, why am I hesitant to hit that? I should be using metronome here, too. Come on. Yeah, just touch it. Oh god, right. God, that blood oath thing was so fucking funny. That was ridiculous. When that happened, I'm scared. Ooh, this one just gives you a bunch of locusts, right? Yeah. Soul of a yeah, exactly. Because that trinket, those trinkets, are very frequently just absolutely worthless. But in the rare times that they aren't worthless. They're very cool, so making it just doubly as likely to get the benefit of the trinket. It's a good take. 
Okay, use metronome. Oh god. What the fuck was that? That was like a delirium thing? Did I use delirious or something? I, I don't know what that was. Uh... No. Uh... The fool is gonna be basically useless unless we find a challenge room. There's didgeridoo in this song. I just noticed. It's fucking awesome. The use of didgeridoos to rival... Uh, Rayman Origins, which had a whole level called Desert of Didgeridoos. Which was a fucking awesome level. It's like the best desert level ever made. Cause desert, desert levels are usually so forgettable. It reminds me, I gotta play, uh, one of the games I, I think I wanna play kinda soon is... New Super Mario Bros. Wii. I kinda like that game. I know that's the one that gets, like, hated on kinda the most, but... That's a fun game. And I wanna play the other ones, too. I never played the Wii U version, I never played 2. I never played Super Luigi U. Uh... Co-op, possibly. I, I don't count on it, honestly, but uh, it could happen. Like, the co-op in that game sucks, but it's funny. It, like, sucks in a funny way. But that's, that's a good game. I really enjoyed just playing New Super Mario Bros. Okay, uh, we're not gonna get locked into this room, so whatever. Graph. Damn it. We're doing so good. We've got so much going for us. Tons of health. Nice damage, nice coverage. Uh, burst damage in the form of laser. Good retention uh, with, with, the, with the bouncing bullets. Really good game design here. Uh, it's really good game design. It's like cringe. Only Jerma can do that. That kind of like tone. I just sound like I'm imitating Jerma. Because I am. You gotta make your own content at a certain point though. Ooh, tech point five. Oh. Oh. That's really cool. <laughs> Fuck yes. And that gave me fun guy. Nice. No, the joystick is whatever. It's also a tears up, but uh, as we learned before, we're at the tear cap. This one, I think we're gonna use to get rid of metronome. I'm sorry, it's just too good. Okay, that's totally fine. This is just a really, like, conventional, good Isaac run. It's not... not particularly goofy. I apologize. Oh. Ooh. All planned. But yeah, I'm getting to the... the reason I started talking about, like, card fight Vanguard and shit... Vanguard! ...is that... I, I want to get to the point... ...with games like that where I am with, like, Isaac now, where I just, like... I can just, like, chill out with the mechanics and, like, experiment with them. You know, and I feel that's, uh... I'm getting there. I'm slowly getting there, I think. I'm getting better at the game. I took a game off of Bella earlier out of, uh... sheer luck. Not a set, not like a match or whatever, but a game. Strength question mark is uh, kind of lame. I'm just gonna use it to use it. It's a neat idea. It's good on bosses, I think.
Thoughts on Ludovico technique? Oh, well, there's not a lot of good game design there. Um, not a fan. No, it's situational. It can be really, really good, but it's usually bad. I'm like hunched over like an asshole right now. My spine is a perfect parabolic arc. Sit up. Everybody at home, sit up. Scratch your face. But uh, don't, don't touch your face, you'll get acne. Fuck. I gotta play Fiend Folio at some point. I, I think I can almost guarantee that I will do that, but... Wow, like, no chests. I wonder if some of them have been replaced by sacks. Judge... Hanged Man, let's use Judge right now. Judgment. Ludovico needs to have a shot speed up as part of it. That's a... That's a pretty good take. Kidney stone. Very funny. Very cool. That's awesome. Uh, that's so cool. Bullet hell pattern. Bullet hell pattern. Some people don't like the kidney stone. I think they're crazy. Oh, right. We're... I forgot. I can go in and fight the lamb. Oh. Oh. Awesome. Really good find. You can never have enough damage. Nor can you ever have enough rings. Can I get a chest, please? Am I crazy or was this luck dog? That was absolute dog. Uh, what was this trinket? Tick. Oh, well. Glad I didn't go in that door. We can fill up this bone heart. I guess we're just saving these charges for possible delirium. Yeah. The sun. I don't think we'll need it. In Mega Satan. Uh, no, but... Yeah, whatever. Oh god. Charge up revelation and then... Blah. <laughs> god. Dodge this, asshole. Oh, void portal. We go in here. We go in here. We don't fight Mega Satan. Yeah. Oh, bring the sun card in there, though. Fuck the 48-hour energy. We could get it off Mega Satan too, but I'm happy with where we're at. Mega Satan doesn't give you anything, so. I do Mega Satan all the time, guys. And hey, the music will actually work for this section, I think. There was a long period of time where whenever I went to Void, it was like we would hear like the first like three seconds of the music over and over again. Okay. I'm like trying to break the rocks with the uh, thing while I'm still shooting for no reason. <laughs> Making it infinitely harder. <laughs> it's a cool song. Okay, uh, I should probably just use the sun straight away. Let's just do it. God, that's so huge. God, that's so huge! This song is so good. This whole soundtrack is so good. The, like, modded anti-birth soundtrack. That, that shit is... Chef's Kiss. As they say. Oh, 
It's like, I get why people don't like Kidney Stone. It's for those occasional moments when, uh... You desperately need to shoot, and you don't have the ability to shoot because Kidney Stone is holding you back. And then you, like, let go of the fire button and, like, try again, and then it, like, resets the timer, and then you get, like, annoyed. And you take damage. Okay, uh... This one that I'm heading towards could very well be Delirium. I should actually, like, look at the game design. <laughs> oh god, go in. I thought it was Delirium for a second because it was like a round guy. Okay, this is whatever. Oh, it's Mum? No, I'm already Mum? Yeah. Dim Bulb. That was my nickname in high school. It's, uh... Fine. I wish I could swallow this curved horn, but... Of course, that's not likely. Let's just, uh... Let's just re-roll this. We're gonna keep it. Re-roll it again. Yeah, I could've got an extra damage from just holding it, but I prefer... I think I prefer Eternal D6. Uh, sad. <laughs> ooh. What am I saying? Ooh, this is fucking... I have a bullshit build right now. Okay, that one could be Delirium. I'm kind of wasting room charges here. I guess we want to, like as efficiently as possible go to the next boss room that could not be Delirium. And then if we need room charges, we're not going to need anything, but I want all the items. I want to kill all the bosses. Ooh. Classic Isaac boss theme. Ah. Uh, would put us at the speed cap, I think. Is it two or three? Yeah, let's do it. Shot speed actually kind of funny. Nice. I think it's two. Down. Grinch. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. For a second I was like, am I just like automatically shooting? It was because kidney stone was still going. Still unloading. Okay, this is definitely a waste. Nay nay, they straight up say nay nay in the song. Whatever. <laughs> we're, we're at one of those builds where you can just sort of move around and shoot in any direction and you'll still win. Okay, go this way for maximum efficiency. I'm at 99 coins and still picking them up. They have brain rot. Goodbye. Fuck is that boss music? Okay. Uh, <laughs> does delirium? That would count as another floor. But ah, oh, sad. So sad. Oh shit! No, waste. Uh, bomb the door. <laughs> No, no, don't die, don't die. Don't hit BBF. Oh, right, you can't bomb the doors. You can't bomb the doors in Womb, actually. I, I thought that was just in, like... Or, no, this is, uh... It's not Womb. I was looking at the floor like an asshole. It's Delirium. It's Delirium in time. Bit of a waste, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna like juice a blood machine here. Hangman, just use it. I don't think we're gonna get anything funny for the rest of the run. Did I? Is this the run where I got chaos? Yeah, I think it was right because I got like the double uh, item room. That's a reroll. Well, no, use it once.
You know what? <coughs> sure. Uh, this is fine. 99 cents. I'll re roll that again. The Steam sale comes in clutch. Finally. I knew it was destined to happen. I, I knew when I picked up that item that it would save us two whole cents later. Okay, I think uh, I re-roll this one more time. It's it's the Minecrafter item. Okay. Let's re-roll it again. Nothing. So disappointing. Okay, I'm gonna. One of them. I feel like is more likely to be delirium than the others. It's the one to the right of this one. Also got a hierophant just like chilling out in the wings there. God damn. Yeah, rubber cement was a good take. Look at this. That's hot. It just like exchanged some of my fucking <laughs> heart containers, my my soul hearts for black hearts. Just upgraded a few of them. Now I think this one. Yep. I was right! Yay! I like being right. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's cool. Are there any pills? Help up. Yeah, yeah, I, I just kind of want to take it for, like, justice. For the health down earlier. Okay, that, that's, that's enough justice. Range up, cool. Uh, I should like pick up a red heart to fill this container. The bone. He was feeling bonely. Okay, whatever. Oh. All right, uh, time to win. Not very exciting, but oh, there's a pill. This could change everything. Infested. I, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a simple win. Ow. Like we got we got too much going for us to lose at this point. It's so satisfying. I do, just looking at this makes me want to play Toho. I'm like, man, I want to dodge that! Huh. Okay, and finish it off. I said, I said, finish it off. With a big bloosh. Okay. I missed his face turning into Spongebob. It looks like this chest just has Brainworm inside of it, but I think Brainworm is just sitting in the perfect spot. That would have been so cool. I want to test it out on like a couple rooms. That's so cool. Now these tears basically just seek from anywhere on the screen because they're going at such wacky angles. Yeah, I don't know why I'm still playing. Uh, let's do another one, I think. Hold on. This one room is bothering me. Cool. Uh, yeah, it was fun, but it was, you know, it was nothing special. We only like special, very special streams. Hold on. I'm gonna let you guys watch the cutscene while I check something. Okay. A little rerun on the like the lame ass run. I'm liking. I'm enjoying Eden today. I think let's do one more. How about like an Eden greed? How do we feel about that? So anyone else that I'm like itching to play to? 
I always like a good, uh, I genuinely, Poopa Stinka on green mode is always fun for me, but. So let's do, let's just do greed eaten. Not greedier, cause fuck, I, I have earned my right to no longer play greedier. Whoa. Pretty good. Is this the one that rerolls rocks? Rerolls Royce. Oh my god, we got a Havel and a movable TNT ba barrel. That's awesome. I wonder if it'll blow them both up, though. So you need two explosions. I don't think the TNT, the, like, extra big TNT counts toward that. But there's a bomb rock. Will it work? Oh my god. Legendary. I should have waited to pick those up. I was too excited. Uh, the, the D12, whatever this dice is that I'm holding, gotta be one of the best items in the game. In my humble opinion. Quince. Oh my god. Huge on greed mode. This is kind of an insane start. Oh my god. Let let me lose. Oh my oh, oh. <laughs> Hold on, D12, work your magic. Petrified poop. Eh, uh, no. That's not Pogus. God, it can make spike traps. It's fucked up. I was like, who's that little guy? That's a Quint. Okay, well, hmm. Cool. Hmm. <laughs> so what have you guys been up to lately? Play any good, uh... Play any good games? You know, Bella and I watched The Queen's Gambit kind of recently. And uh, it was actually really, really good. I thought it was based on a true story for whatever reason, and then like halfway through I looked it up and I was like, oh, it's not. But it was really good regardless. Uh, I just thought it was really weird when she like jumped up on the table and she went, it's, it's Gambit in time. And then she just, like, Queen's Gambited all over the place. I, I thought that was really weird. See, it works because there was a scene where she jumps up on a table and does something ridiculous. But, but not that. So it's like people who watch the show are like, oh, I know what scene he's talking about. Oh no, I no, he's being a fucking dickhead. Cool. That scene is great. That is amazing. That made me laugh so hard. Because, like, in my head, I guess mild spoilers for uh, Queen's Gambit. Like, end of the first season, I think. Or, not first season, first episode, because it's like, it's like eight episodes. Uh, when she just started... I, like, I was thinking in my head, I was like, what if she just started, like, eating, like, handfuls of pills? Or, like, poured them into her mouth? And then she just did... She just did that. It was fucking awesome. Oh wait, get rid of these red poops. No, it's like a mini-series, it's not a movie. And it was good. I don't, I don't really have much to say besides it was good. I don't know. I don't know much about, like, TV and movies. Uh... 
I think we want to go with Angel. Right, because I have the feather. I'm silly. I forgot I had the feather. Uh, we're going to just hang on to our money. I'm a guy who hangs on to the money until, like, near the very end. And then I start, like, spending. It's just wait to see a good item on the next floor. Because why spend it on re-rolling or buying items here when you could just go to the next floor? But then you, like, get to the last... You get to, like, the shop floor. And it's, uh... It doesn't have a re-roll machine, and you're like, oh. And it's got a bunch of trash items. Uh... Okay, yeah, I don't want any of these. Let's just go. Really good start. Uh, more, again... It really... The streamer mode with Isaac really is a thing, I think. Because, like, that shit... It's always, like, something goofy happens in, like, every run. Like, the D12 shenanigans that we witnessed. That's not bad. I'll take it. This item always feels kind of cheap because it's something you can just get from pills anyway, but... You know. <laughs> That's an irrational thought to have. Oh, these are some good-ass items. <laughs> Uggers. Uggers. Uh, I think I'm going to take the damage up. My god! Uh... Yeah? I'll take that. Oh my... God! Streamer mode is real. Don't believe what they say. Streamer mode is 100% real. We install a mod... ...that makes the game, like, more crazy. Oh shit, there's an invisible one. Thankfully, I have my quits. Uh, I'll be out. I fucking hate these eternal enemies. Also, the Robo Baby just always drives me fucking nuts. The noise that it makes. Noise! Oh. I should use the fucking- what am I doing? Use the D12, man. It'll give you that black poop for free, bro! I kind of forgot they- they nerfed- or they buffed the D10 like crazy. And it is now like... a god item. Not a god item, but it's really crazy. It's- it's insanely detailed. Oh, he jumped there because he was scared. I was like, did he target my quints? Yeah, it devolves enemies. It, like, turns them into the worst version of themselves. And then if they're at the bottom of their, like, evolutionary line, they just die. And then there's certain ones, like the tiny little grub worms that you find, like, in the corpse. Uh... Those turn into, like, the little environmental worms. Here, I'll look for one. Uh, they're kind of hard to even, like, spot. Hmm. But the, the little ones that, like, wriggle around on the ground. It's like, and, and flies, a single black fly will turn into, like, these kinds of flies. Like, the two that are buzzing to the right of my head here. Which, I think, die when you shoot at them? Yeah. It's such a tiny, tiny little detail that I played this game for years and never noticed that. Uh... Oh my god, these items. These are nuts. Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that a couple of mines were perhaps blown just now. Who were in a similar situation to me. I can see for health down. down. Awesome. Bob's brain. <laughs> Bob's brain. Fuck that. 
I'm done being funny. Uh. Oh. The map is bad, the candle is not good, Trisagian is the pick. What happens if, if I can re-roll the angel into a devil? Oh. No, one of them's just gone. Okay. Yeah, no bomb. It's... you hate to see it. Ooh! Fuck! I'm sad that I got this at the very end of the floor. Cause now, uh... I really want to bring this. Like, having it just for one floor and then ditching it would be nice. Damn. Sucks. Ah, I'm really torn on this. What do you guys think? Because the feather... I didn't get a key piece just now, which not only means I didn't get to reap the benefit of the, fe of the feather, but I'm also going to have less likelihood of getting an angel room in the future. Feather, 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 okay. Yeah, feather is cooler. That's a good argument. Feather is cooler. Everybody's saying feather. Yeah, that, I'm thinking that... Okay, somebody said penny is more value, but I, it seems like a lot... A lot more people are uh, thinking feather, so fine. I agree that it's like it's like the interesting option because you can save money with the uh, the key one. Like across the run, it would save me like twenty cents or something, assuming we don't get sales on keys. Uh, tell you what, we have a bone heart conveniently to do this. The fact that this is a common strat. Oh. And I kind of got fucked over, but that's fine. Uh, common strat is when an item gives you an HP up, just do the curse room first. Uh, I could just take the little hearts there, but whatever. That was that was a rare that was a rare L of that strat, but it really isn't that bad. I'm stompy. I can fly! Oh, birthright. Oh, uh, huh. Not very good, is it? Spawns three random items from random item pools. Only one can be taken. It's just a single Genesis round, basically, that's randomized. Also, taking damage has a 100% chance for Isaac to explode. Is it normally not 100%? I thought it was always 100%. Maybe just the number is glowing, but it's still the same, or was it like 50? Because why would it say... Why would it say there's a chance? It would just say taking damage makes Isaac explode if it was 100% guaranteed. That's... You gotta, you gotta deduce. I don't have a key. Oh, but I haven't done this floor yet. Uh, okay. Hanged man. Kind of useless. They nerfed it to be 50. They nerfed that item. I guess, uh... Fuck. Tainted Maggie with that item is, like, unbelievably good. Common Tainted Maggie W. The excessively common Tainted Maggie Dub. Taking a really, like, mid-item and then turning it into- I hate the way I talk. Turning it into something amazing. Vocabulary Andy. Stop. <laughs> okay, Bloody Gust. The tomb is kind of cool. They require a key to unlock. God damn it. And they can give you angel items. God damn it. Bloody Gust is cool for greed mode too. Uh, I'm polydactyly. No, I think I, I want to take the tomb.
that's that's a cool item. Even though I gotta spend more on keys. I've committed, speaking of spending on keys. Habit is neat, but not with what I have. Oh! Oh! Uh -huh. God damn. That is good. Here's that goofy shit we do like. Now give me like Ipecac. Look at them in the corner. <laughs> what the fuck are they doing? They're fucking. No bomb! No bomb. Fuck, look at how all of them are grouped up there. Shit, I forgot to buy a bomb. I'm such an asshole. Okay, we take the rainbow thing, oh my god. I am stompy. <gasps> I forgot. Ow. Woo! Raz... Raz lags? Laz rags. It's better than nothing. Dementia Danny. Stop. But go on. Uh, whatever. <laughs> oh, excuse me. What are we on now, Necropolis? This is the part where I start doing this at the end of the floor. Fuck. Okay, I didn't want any of that anyway. Blue cap. The <laughs> real voice. <laughs> make. We gotta make new jokes. I have to create original content or else I'm gonna go to jail. Ma I no more Germa jokes. I'm getting this. Okay. Uh, I'm at tier cap, I think. 20 tiers. I think. I don't have any money for anything but fucking data miner, which is the worst. Uh, no, let's get two keys. Doesn't hanger break tear cap? Are we gonna do this again? Oh god. I, like, it's it's not much of a risk, so I should just pick it up. Because it's very... The only reason I'm leaving it there is on the chance that I didn't re-roll it. Oh shit, whatever. Waste of a soul heart half. Oh, do I not have flight? Uh, right, I just have Stompy, not flight. Okay. It, it's... This effect is overwhelming, as usual. Classic Trisasian move. Oh, another funny little item. Yeah, no. The tear cap might be even be broken now, but 20 is just the new tear cap because uh, almond milk. Like, maybe normally almond milk sets it to like 16. They literally stood there and did nothing that entire fight. Spider butt. I think it actually did something to them, which is nice. I mean, a bit of a bit right, Andy. Huh? 
Oh yeah, Isabel and I watched Rango last night. And, uh, I've heard the praises of that movie a lot, but... Like, I watched it as a kid, and I had the classic kid-watching-Rango experience where I was like, What is this? What am I watching? Is this real? And, uh... It was really good. Oh, I can use Hangman to save the half a soul, or one half a soul heart here. It is really good. Shocking how good it looks. It's from 2011. It just looks so good. Like, the characters are... Most of them are pretty profoundly, like, hideous, but... It's animated really well. They're, like, intentionally made, like, gross-looking. Uh... I'm gonna take the poopy pill. Yes. Yes, we might as well take this out anyway. Okay, I don't need bombs... ...anymore, so I don't need to worry about that. I'm just gonna wait. What floor are we on? Scarred Womb? Yeah, we've got, what, two more floors? So I'm just gonna save my money. I'm not gonna buy anything here. Because as usual, sing-along folks, the goal is not to beat greed, but to humiliate greed. Oh, nice. Don't have to blow my angel chance. Spawns Esau as a temporary secondary character for one room. He spawns with as many passive items as the player. Okay, so that's like Esau Jr., but risk-free, basically. He could still fuck with you somehow, but... Hmm. Let's take it. I wish I could black rune the health down pill out of spite. Friends till the end. Very cool. What is this one again? Two health up, one tears up, one point three five tears up. Tiny amount of speed down. No. I'm taking the funny Jacob and Esau. Uh, yeah, we're not buying anything, and this is the other active item that is not actually good. Let me be abundantly clear. Oh god. Yeah, I'm- I'm hemorrhaging money because of the, uh, the extra money I need to spend on the key here. You're really, you're really busting my balls, game. This is worth buying. Cool. Uh, that, sure. Uh, worth, actually? Even though I just bought two keys, I think? Let's just take it. It's, it's on sale. Oh, I have six. I'm an asshole. Well, let's go open shit up. How about I open this first and then I get pay to win or whatever, or pay to play. Like, getting that key door item really early on is, of course, amazing. Getting it this late in the game is, like, just barely worth it. But also the fact that it's an on-sale item. You kind of want to keep buying those. Even though that's a bit of a gamble. I'm kind of banking on the idea that I'll have more things to unlock than just doors. But that is a reach. Wizoobs. Did you guys know that those, uh, those ghost enemies that teleport around are called Wizoobs? The, like, non-red ones, I mean. That's, that's the whole story. That's it. It's just a funny name. It's just good. Oh, God! Fuck you! <laughs> uh, chests contain more pickups. All in on getting, like, six chests in the next floor. All in. Fuck! I could afford that. I could, I could do it once. I could do it a bunch of times. Fuck, man. No. No, I think we, uh... I think we reset this one. No. Don't want those. Ooh, I got a dime out of that. Hell yeah. 
Uh, no, Deep Pockets would have been... No, it's... Deep Pockets is actually not really good on green mode, usually. Okay, we can see this room now. Cool. Should have tried to crooked penny it. I should be trying to like call what items I use when I do this. Uh, like I'm gonna pick this up and I'm gonna put it down to re-roll it. <gasps> that would have been awesome. Flight. That's cool. Now I got three. Math. Okay, we're gonna use this. Oh god. Oh, he gets like a bunch of. I see. It really just spawns a second character and then gives them a bunch of items, and you even get like the benefits of picking them up. That's actually really cool. I don't. I don't know if I've ever used that trinket before. Or that rune. I'm having difficulty telling what's going on. Because that was one of my last unlocks, was Hush with, uh, Tainted Jacob. I don't want any of these, I'm just gonna spam the funny scrolls on this boss. Monster Manuel. Mr. Boom. Mr. Boom! <laughs> what, I can't pick that up? What? What do you mean I can't pick that big battery up? That's not me! That's my, like, clone. Fuck. Good. Spirit sword. I'm sorry. I have spirit sword right now. Okay. Guess that happened from the scrolls. Oh, what? Am I crazy or am I, like, bumping into items without picking them up, even though I can pick them up? My own clone! Now neither of us will be virgins! We roll this. Fuck! Right, again. It's- it's still the Esau. Is he still here? No. I see. Okay. I'm gonna... Yeah, that's worth it. The fact that that coin for key item even affects those little key blocks and chests, I think it was updated to do that, right? Uh... Champion belt is the most tempting one. I say we just uh, look for bigger, better things. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Monsters 2. I'm glad there were enemies in the room, because otherwise that would have fucking hit me. Maybe. Necronomicon, cool. I should just be spamming this thing, shouldn't I? That was the strategy all along, Monster Manuel. Does it still have the, like, random chance to say Monster Manuel when you pick it up? I was astounded to hear that that was a real thing. I had never heard of that until, like, pretty recently. That that was, like, in the original... Or no, it was, like... It, it was misspelled in the original. And then it had a chance to happen in this one, right? Am I getting that right? Book of Revelations. Uh, that won't affect the bosses in greed mode, will it? What do we got? And it's poo-poo. Oh, look at this. <laughs> look at the shopkeeper with the baby. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. No, we don't want these. Oh, D6. We want these. We want these. And I could even take a bit of a gamble and say that... Oh, monster. No, we don't want that spider. I'm gonna gamble on this 
razor being good because I'm gonna buy it for 10 cents and then hope I re-roll it into something that's worth more than 10 cents. Chaos. Oh. Oh yeah. Well, eh. Oh god. It only takes away your red hearts, right? Yeah. And, uh... I'll spend some of my soul hearts. Oh god, and we got this too. Huge. Uh, is there a bomb in the shop? Yes, there is. That, uh... No. That didn't fuck up the ability to buy two things. Cool! I don't want to waste these soul hearts. All right. I don't even know what I'm fighting. Oh, it's the bone worms. Yo, speaking of new Super Mario Bros. Wii. The bone coasters level? Fucking insane. One of the best. What a, what a cool gimmick. Ooh, god damn it, this one gives me health, but it gives me fun guy. And I'm gonna get this, fuck you. It'll lessen the amount of, like, damage that I get. Or benefit that I get from the, uh, blood oath, but whatever. I don't think I'm even gonna take the liver. I, I don't think I even take that. I think I try to re-roll it or something. Ace of clubs. Uh, damn. That would have been nice during, like, the greed mode part. Let's re-roll the shop. Someone said re-roll for the battery, and I think that's a good idea. This is just damage. Eh. Oh! <laughs> yeah, boy! That's cool. Uh, shit, there wasn't a, uh, there wasn't a battery there, was there? Fuck. And as much as I'd like to take that, well, hold on. Oh, and it's got the rainbow, too. I forgot about that. One coin, please, sir. Fuck you. Fuck you. Well, that's it. Unless the battery's on sale. No. Now it is truly hopeless. The golden pill. Damn, crown of light is there. That sucks. Whatever. Uh. I'm not gonna take this because I want some. No, because we're gonna demolish. No, this gives me more damage. It makes me more of a glass cannon. Because of blood rights. Is it blood rights or oath? Blood oath, I think. Yeah, crown of light would not have uh, procced because of blood oath anyway. I do have Lazarus's rags. Teardrop charm, that's like the tear effects happen more often. Yeah. Uh, killing an enemy has a 5% chance to spawn a dead bird. That's fucking hilarious that at 8 luck, every enemy spawns a dead bird. That's insane, actually. That is fucking ludicrous. We don't really need range, we got tech X, so I guess I'm taking these two. I turned your minions into bombs. How does that make you feel? Oh, thank you for the steam cell, sir. This is how you want to end a greed mode run with, like, no money. It's not actually true, because the greed machine, but, you know. It's not, it's not really a terribly funny run. Some funny things happen. Let's try to, like, get him with as much of the rainbow as possible. It's kind of hard to circle him at all times, but... Oh.
Fuck, I should have been thinking about the key move. I should have taken that dead bird trinket. Your boy's gonna die. This does not do as much damage as I thought it would. Like, I know he's got boss armor, but... But it's cool seeing Fruity Plum's attacks go through my, uh, prism. I guess I have Lazrags, too. I'm not gonna die. I'm just gonna stand still. I don't even need to move. Very cool. Well, you know... Look at this dude. These are all good shopkeeps. Holy shit. I want to see the sitcom between these three. There's one that's behind Greed's ass who will forever be imprisoned there. Rip. Yeah, you, I'm sure there's a mod that does this, but uh, the one thing that I don't really enjoy about doing normal Greed is that there's no phase two on that fight. I really wish it was a native option in the game that like greedier mode like, if Greedier Mode didn't do the thing where it gives you less money over time, I would play that all the time. But the fact that it gives you less money is just, like, fucked up to me. Uh, okay. We're done. That was, like, 3.15? Yeah. Pretty cool. Uh, now... We're, should we go raid somebody? That was a fun stream. I feel like a lot of dumb shit happened. Which is all you can ask for. It's hard to, uh, you know, it's hard to top some of the things that we've seen in that game, but every once in a while, every once in a while, it does happen, and I'm like, whoa. Uh, who's streaming? Mike is streaming King of the Castle. It, did I, like, dream this, or did somebody say that Mike was streaming Celeste? Did Mike stream Celeste? Let me look at his thing. I, I swear I got, like, a, a YouTube comment or something that was like, yeah, you know how you were talking about Mike playing, about Vinny playing Celeste? Well, Mike is playing it right now. I think I might have dreamed that. <laughs> I think I might have dreamed that. Okay, let's just go raid Mike, whatever. Uh, hold on, I always fuck up the little raid prompt. Nice raid. Okay, uh, well, let's go just have a little raid. He's playing whatever. He might be playing Mario Kart. That's kind of interesting. I think I want to go play Mario Kart with my boo right now. Because we've been playing that game lately. She still whoops my ass every time. Basically without fail. There was one time that she, like, she, like, was on her phone while the race was starting. And, like, took a second to pause it or something, and then I won. But that was it. And she like, sat there for like 10 seconds or something at the beginning of the race. That was the only time I won. But it's still fun. Uh, okay, have fun with the raid. Uh, thanks for watching. Isaac, never. Yes, I do want a tip. I can call you and give you a secret. Go ahead, call. Grapefruit with the raid. Thank you, buddy. Oh, man. Thank you so much. I hope you're having a good night, dude. Um, Oh, I appreciate that, man. Can we get a shout out for Grapefruit in here? Mods, if there's any mods here. Sloth with 22 months. Thanks, man. Hello? Hey, so first tip. Uh -huh. Go ahead and call so that way they can't hear it. So we can give oh, you, you want? Oh, you want to be muted? Yeah, mute me real quick so that way I can give you secret tips. Okay. All right. Okay. So they can't hear. They, they, not, they, not, no. Hold on. You muted yourself. I muted dude. myself. Okay, I muted myself. I, I sure did. Okay, so right. the way that you mute you is by clicking. Okay, hold on. Yep, yep. You'd probably. Got it. Okay, I got I got it. Yeah, they can't hear you. They can't, I figured it out. We got there. We got there. Go ahead. 